and welcome back to another YouTube video. I'm gonna show you with the surfer balance what you have to do for exercises to start with and to how to improve your surf balance with the help of your balance board. All you need is your balance board, a nice surface, usually flat, where you can train on and you put obviously the roll in the middle again and the board next to it. If you haven't watched the first video about the balance board introduction, you can just click up here and watch this video first because I show you in the first video how to really step on the board and start your balance session. So the main goal to, uh, yeah, to train with a balance board is obviously to be better in surfing. And that's why it's really handy to train with the balance board because our, our deep muscle tissues have to train and you will gain more balance. More balance means better surfing skills. But you have to have in mind that a balance board is called training. So make this clear. So surfing stability balance is when you train with the balance board, not as difficult as it is with your balance board. I hope that's clear because you see a lot of people shaking, yourself feeling more shaking. This is training because it's more difficult uh, as in surfing, but it will prepare yourself to be having better balance. So with a better balance, you have more fun with the surfing. Before you start exercising, always make sure that you're safe. Put some pillows around it. Put something underneath so you feel safe. So it could happen that you fall. If you feel more secure because it's the beginning of you, the first time training with a balance board, it's also handy to put some protectors on. Why not? Better safe than sorry. So let's get right into it because like I said, the first video I showed you how to step on a balance board and the most important one is put it two thirds on one side and then you step on first the lower end like here, and then you go on this. Nothing happens so far and then with stability, lower your knees, you go to the sides, shift your weight to the side and it will come up. You saw it already? Oh yes, shaky shaky. One more time, you go to the side and then you roll. I'm not in the middle, so I'm gonna turn it more like to this way and I start from here, same here, step on, shift to the sides, I'm here. You see already that my body, look at this, my legs are shaking, yeah? When it's shaking, whoop, oh, my legs are already working like hell, so for you, to shake, it's all good to do that because to start with. First important exercise is to warm up first. So instead of just jumping on like what I did, warm up first, it will help you. Nevertheless, one of the first exercises you should improve is the follow. You go first on your balance board and you stay there, yeah? What helps you to stay there is you go lower in your knees, yeah? I can almost stay there the whole time like, okay, I feel it, everything comes out of my hip, so you, um, so you stay in your lower knee. The second tip I want to give you is, never straighten your, uh, your knees like this, never, because it doesn't give you stability. Another important tip is about posture, same in surfing, your arms are not going higher than shoulder high, yeah? Here it's nice to have balance, if you stay lower it's even better, because the gravity point is more down there. But if you go up here, you will feel it. You can try it at home. You lose balance, yeah? So your arms are not getting higher than shoulder high. So really important tip when you think about the balance board. So when you're training, have already in mind two things, stay lower in your knees and the arms are not getting higher than shoulder high. This is where we get stability. This is where we're gonna have fun with the balance board. Now it comes. When we think about surfing, yeah, to train this balance already a few minutes a day, it's like helping you balance wise, but it almost has to do nothing with surfing. Because surfing, we're more going to the sides, like we're, we're surfing the rail to rail instead of going down and up, you know what I mean? So important is to train your surfing stance with the balance board. So the whole training with the balance board is to improve your surfing. So what you can do is for example play a bit around to shift the weight sideways because 
we're not standing on a surfboard like this, like in a squat position. No, we're standing more like 90 degrees in the back and 45 degrees in the front because I'm uh, regular. And then my both hands are facing this way. So when I'm facing this way already, the whole balance changes. Yeah, if we think about, okay, imagine I'm surfing, just feeling the balance of the, wow, the simulation training of surfing. This is already way different instead of standing like this on a balance board. So the first exercise to come closer to a more realistic training is switch your feet and go to a surf position. You see already? It's way different, yeah? When I stay here, chest over front knee. By the way, I made a whole video about how your stance should be in surfing. Check out here, here, maybe, I don't know. There's a link beneath, subscribe anyway. So, the first exercise is go in your surfing stance, if you're goofy or uh, regular, it's already good for your legs, and try this different position on the balance board. You will feel already like, Oh, I'm surfing. Just imagine you're surfing down there, down the line. Feel the balance. This is already amazing because once you hit the water again, you will feel like, oh, my balance improved a lot. That was a quick and easy video. If you enjoyed it, subscribe, comment, leave below what kind of exercises or harder exercises for surfers I should tell you which is important with a balance board. And let me know if you're training already with the balance board. And nevertheless, if you never heard about me, I'm Daniel, Surf Companions co-founder. And with the Surf Companions book, courses, surf camps, we improve your surfing. Can't wait to see you in the next video. And uh, yeah, improve your surfing.